Shout a bit. We wanna shock the place and knock the place about a bit. We wanna wake it up, shake it up. Then we wanna break it up and, and get the silly fatty that is out of it. I wanna do my level best to see that no one gets any rest. Then you're hand in hand and louder than the band. Your happy heart starts singing a song. And up go the lights, out go the flags. Sweet tingle-ingle of excitement, excitement. Don't you feel, don't you know, the indescribable glow of excitement tonight? Extra, extra, hey, look at the headline. Historical news is being made. Extra, extra, they're drawing the red line around the biggest scoop of the decade. The barrel of time. it like me if there's a wrong way to do it a right way to screw it up nobody does it like me i've got a big loud mouth i'm always talking much to free if you go for tags and manners better stay away from me if there's a wrong way to keep it cool a right way to be a fool I just muck it up. Nobody does it like me. And so she tries to be a lady. I'm no lady, I'm a fraud. When she talks like she's a lady. What I sound like is a fraud. There's a wrong way to get a guy. The right way to lose a guy. Nobody does it like me. Sparkle like a neon sign For short time on Broadway
think that's a marvellous idea. Yes, I do. I sure do. Our very own singing venture local choir. Are you ready? Whenever you are, Tally. <laughs> then we begin. Climb upon my knee, sunny boy. Do up. No, you're only three, sunny boy. Do up. There's no way of knowing. And there's no way of showing altogether what you mean to be, <laughs> Sunny Boy. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Did you like that? Did you like my choir? Did you? Eh? Yes? Oh, well, just a little leg pull. <laughs> Actually, I've just got a couple of minutes to talk to you now because, uh, do you like the watch, by the way? Can you see that? Do you like that? Brand new. That, before, you know, I had one of those waterproof, shockproof, dustproof, fireproof ones. But I lost it. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. I had this one as a present. Now, the lady told me, she said that, who gave it to me? She said, it actually tells you the time, which is daft. Who's ever, who's ever heard of a talking watch, eh? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I'll try it. Let's see. You just pull this out here like this. At the first stroke, it will be six. 17 and 10 seconds precisely. Doop, doop. Is it marvellous? Doop. <laughs> hey, that's very... I tell you. <laughs> oh, well, no, please, no. No cause for alarm. <laughs> <laughs> these watches are very popular, I must admit, because one of the girls in the show, one of the toppers, got one of these watches and she was talking to a friend. I overheard her speak. She said, do you know that fellow that took me out last night? Was he bold? Oh, he was bold. <laughs> do you know, she said, I'd only just got in the car and he started. The other one said, well, you should have clocked him. She said, I did. Two minutes, 12 seconds flat. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, while we're on that subject, you know, one of the, one of the senior members uh, of, of, the, of the show, the minstrels, he said that his daughter went out with this fella. And do you know, he didn't bring him back, or didn't bring her back, <laughs> he didn't bring her back until 7 o'clock in the morning. As the father was waiting there, he said, all right. He said, what's the idea? He said to this fellow, of bringing my daughter back, 7 o'clock in the morning, this fella said, well, I've got to. I start work at eight. <laughs> <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, I've actually just got time now to introduce the <laughs> next <laughs> item. <laughs> and <laughs> if I could... <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Bertie Brontosaurus. Now, what are you doing here? Listen, I was just about to introduce the next item. Oh, I thought you were going to introduce my song. <laughs> introduce your song? Yeah. Listen, I told you last week that you can't sing on the show. Well, I've been practising my scales. Your scales? Uh, yeah. Well, you've got plenty of them, I suppose. Listen, if, uh, uh, what's your top note like? Do you know, my top note is so high, it's got snow on it. Has it really? <laughs> Fancy that. Well, what were you going to sing today for us, anyway? An animal song. An animal song? Oh, I see. What's it called? M-A-B, it's a big horse. M-A-B, it's a big horse? Yeah. Well, how does it go? Am I be it a big old Simon <laughs> London? <laughs> nostalgia, nostalgia, the thing that they want is nostalgia, all the magic they knew in the past. Remember, remember, it seems that they're bound to remember all the memories that are Hall where we'd go to see Gracie or Flanagan and Alan sing hits of the day. The songs that they sang were all the rage then, and who can deny they deserve their fame? Nostalgia, nostalgia, they're pleading for nostalgia. Nostalgia. Every night. 
Just watch the ivy on that old garden wall Clinging so tightly, whatever may be As you grow older, I'll be constant and true Any evening, any day, you'll find us all doing the Lambeth walk. Oi! Every little Lambeth gal with her little Lambeth pal, you'll find them all doing the Lambeth walk. Everything's free and easy. You lads, you done well, crazy. Why don't you make your way there? Go there, stay there. Once again. Like you. There are a few kind sir, but simple girls and proper too. Then tell me, pretty maiden, what these very simple girlies do? Kind sir, their manners are perfection, and the opposite of mine. Then take a little walk with me, and then I can see what the most particular girl should I be. I beg of you. would matter in the world today. 
wonderful things to do if you were the only girl in the world and I were the only boy. So we sang when all the rain fell and who can deny they deserve their pain. Nostalgia, nostalgia, Super Chronic, take one. Stand by, Gary. Cue motorbike. Cue Gary. Still together after all that we've been through I'm all stuck here and there, it's all still fun with blue So take a look at me, I'm only 43 I'll still be here when Alvin's gone right up his cuckoo I love you, you love me too I'm here. <laughs> Love you. Have the more you want. 
one they say But enough is as good as a feast any day If you have any more, Mrs. Moore You'll never get to your street door Too many double gins give the ladies double gins So don't have any more, Mrs. Moore Money is the root of all Okay. Take it away. And I'm following the father's footsteps. I'm following the dear old dad. He is just in front with a fine big gal. So I thought I'd have one as well. I don't know where he's going, but when he gets there, I'll be glad. I'm following the father's footsteps, yes. I'm following the dear old dad. Jolly good company. Never mind the weather, never mind the rain. Now we're all together. Whoops, 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 she goes again. La 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 di da di da. La 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 di da di di. All good pals and jolly good company. Wow! As I cruised out one evening upon a night's career. I spied a lofty clipper's chip and to her I did steer. I hoisted out my signals, which she so quickly knew. And when she saw my bunting fly, she immediately hove to hoo hoo. She had a dark and a rolling eye. Fill your basket full of sandwiches and weenies Then lock the house up, now you're set And on the beach you'll see the girls in their bikinis As cute as ever, but they never get them wet Whoa, 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 she began to bump a little bit bump was clinging to the great jib bull. She rolled up and fell in the dump. I clung to the captain's backs and cried, what ho, ha <laughs> she bumps. I don't mind if I do. She said, if you be my papa, then I will be your ma, Mary. She pinches cheek and say, you can't say. She say, not now, dear, but later I may. She said, come bring me for papa. And she said, oh la la, oui. How are you going to keep me down in the bar after the sea? Gonna keep her from Piccadilly jazzing around and painting the town. How you gonna keep her away from art? That's a mystery. They'll never wanna see a rake or plow. And who the deuce can polyvoo a cow? How you gonna keep her away from art? 
Well, thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. And now I can meet another friend of mine. His name is Cuddles. But I've got to wake him up. He's having a sleep. Just excuse me. Will you? Will you wake up? We're here. You can't. I, d I just said, we're here. Oh, no, there's no need to shout. There's no need to shout. I think there's no need to shout, is there? Hang on, Pat, would you be quiet? You know. I said, be quiet, calm down, and have a look. Have a look, yeah, tonight. Yes, I will. Right. Have a look. Oh, no, go. No! Oh, sorry. I'm sorry, come here. I'm sorry. I'll get it started. <laughs> you see, ladies and gentlemen, what's happened? We've come here tonight. And what are you going to try and do? I've got the legs stuck. Be quiet. It start off by doing a song. No, I've got the legs stuck. Mind you, we might do a trick. I've got the legs stuck! <laughs> I beg your pardon? I beg your pardon? I've got the legs stuck in the box of nothing. I'm done, and so I feel so something there looking like that in that jacket on me. Do you realise I come down here to do something clever? What goes on? So I get the lid on the leg, you see. <gasps> I've got the legs stuck. Have you? <laughs> oh, I see you. You've got your legs stuck. I know. <laughs> get it out, I'll get it out. Yes, if I can just, there we are. Thank you. So, and the legs stuck. <laughs> now, what we're going to do yes. is show the ladies and gentlemen the trick. How are we? Yes, I'm a magician. Are you going to magic? I'm going to magic. Good. And uh, I don't do that. What? Sniff. I didn't sniff. You did. I didn't, you did. I didn't, you did. I'm sorry. It's all right. <laughs> if, uh, <laughs> yeah. if we do this trick, it'll be marvellous. Now, I want you to sit on here. All right. Yeah, I'll get on. There we are. Oh, now, gold. If we can... Hang on. What are you doing? It's cold. It's <laughs> look, it isn't cold. Ah, but you're not a monkey, are you? Eh? <laughs> <laughs> now this trick yes. is a marvellous trick tonight. Uh, with what? A balloon. A balloon? <laughs> yes, I have a balloon. He's got a balloon. <laughs> I know what I've got. You've got a balloon. You know what you are? A baboon. <laughs> I'm sorry. Now I'll blow this up. Now sit here. Watch it. Go. <gasps> I think they get all right. I think they get all right. Go on, yeah. Nah, nah. I think they get all right. Nah, 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 nah. Will you stop it? Sorry. There we are. Right? Now that's it. Is that it? Yes. Good. That's good, that, isn't it? Yeah. Now listen, I'm actually going to put this somewhere. Are you really? Oh, yes. <laughs> I hope you let some of the air out first. <laughs> yeah. right. Here we go. Right. Get hold of this. <laughs> Now sit there, don't move, and don't talk. I, I can't talk with this stuck on me. God, Lord, it's good with you. <laughs> That's you can. Sorry, ladies and gentlemen, this evening I will show you a trick with a pin. What we actually do is take a pin with a pin, you can paste it through a pin. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, it's not supposed to happen. But you see, what happens is the trick. <laughs> she flies in the sky. <laughs> now stop that, cuddle. Sit there, don't move, and don't let the air out. Right. If it. <laughs> Will you speak? <laughs> hey, hey, you Honestly, listen, I couldn't take you anywhere, could I? Well, you know me to. Why not? Because I've been everywhere, man. <laughs> We've been everywhere, man. Never going to care, man. Never pay a fair man. We've had our share, man. Tell you where we've been. Round the Gilford, Oxford, the Tanta Bay, the Chingford, Hemphill, the Dancers, Shrewd, the Canterbury, Ainsbury, Liverpool, Scumport, Stanford, Mayport, Thunderthor, Whitehall, Dantford, Brindle, Denford, Newport, Stockport, 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 Who's B? 
been here since I've been gone. Where the harem scarum did up there, up up to the big candy bee. Well, for our finale tonight, we've chosen five of Noel Coward's most amusing songs. I hope you're going to enjoy them. Thanks very much for being with us tonight, and I hope we're going to see you again next week. Goodbye. <laughs> Supply the bathroom burst and the lavatory makes you fear the worst. It was used by Charles the First, wiped informally, and later by George the Fourth on a journey north. The State Department's keep their historical renown. It's wiser not to sleep there in case they tumble down. But still, if they ever catch on fire, which with any luck they might, we'll fight for the stately homes of England. of a crazy younger son who murdered in 1351 an extremely rowdy nun who resented it and people who come to call meet her in the hall the baby in the guest wing who crouches by the grate was walled up in the west wing in 1428 if anyone spots the queen of scots in a hand embroidered shroud we're proud of the stately home for me Isn't very sane to make the things you can't attain. Still you always try. If you find that you're blind with devotion for delightful Mrs. Brown, you'll appreciate eloping with her much, much more if her husband comes along and knocks you down. Oh, there's always something fishy about. In the small suspicion that behind their savoir faire they share a common content for every mother's son of us. Though they smile and smirk, we know they won't for dirty work. We most polite, but don't put out the night light. Every wise and thoroughly worldly wench knows there's always something fishy about the French. Oh, there's always something fishy about the French As a race they're conscientious But undoubtedly licentious Though the compliments they pay are gay And, and ever so nice we don't believe a word of them They may kiss our hands And talk to us of foreign lands We talk and walk and watch for je ne sais quoi Every time their fingers begin We show there's something fishy about We know there's something fishy about the French And rude and boast of a crude and lordly.
Obviously disdainful for mind and for brain Though obtuse and slow-witted We're not to be pitied For we follow the prince Every orgy with our Georgie Lasts till dawn without a loud We can venture without censure To be noisy, drunk and dull Sclerosis and gout All our children will rue our mistakes Roistering Regency Rakes Roistering Regency Rakes The pavilion cost a million As a monument to art And the wits here say it sits here Like an orient Art. The dashing Beaumont has ruffled our pond And even the turbot, no Mrs. Fitzherbert We're, We're richer than ever before The Brighton is Brighton no more, no more Brighton is Brighton no more The Japanese don't care to, the Chinese wouldn't dare to. A Hindus and Argentines sleep firm from 12 to 1. But Englishmen detest a siesta. Oh. In the Philippines, there are lovely screens to protect you from the glare. In the Malay states, there are hats like plates which the Britishers won't wear. At 12 noon, the wait is swoon and no further work is done. But mad dogs and Englishmen go out in the midday, out in the midday. Out in the midday sun Yes, mad clouds and Englishmen Go out in the midday sun The smallest melee rabbit Deplores this stupid habit In Hong Kong they strike a gong And fire off a noonday gun Bang. Bang. To reprimand each inmate Who's in late In the mangrove swamps Where the python rocks There's beasts from 12 to 2 Even caribous lie round and snooze For there's nothing else to do In Bang but mad dogs and Englishmen go out in the midday, out in the midday, out in the midday. Out in the midday. 